Meet Daisy, she's got a way of making beautiful things. You never know what nature will teach her, what inspiration will bring. D-O-Y, D-O-Y, Daisy, what are we making today? D-O-Y, D-O-Y, Daisy, I bet we'll make something great. Hello, Gumboot Kids. Hi, Daisy. I was out in my garden this morning when I spotted a butterfly perched on a flower. It inspired me to make a nature craft. Would you like to make some flower petal art, Gumboot Kids? Yay! Step one, head outside and collect some flower petals. This craft is best if the flowers are pressed. Place some flowers and leaves flat inside a heavy book. Close the book and then leave it for a while. Look at these flowers that I pressed. They're perfect. Step two, gather some paper and glue. Here's some paper for you. Thank you. And you. Imagine what your butterfly will look like. Step three, use your flower petals as the butterfly's wings. Glue them to the paper. Have fun. There's no right or wrong way to make a nature craft. This is fun. I love nature crafts. It can take a while for the glue to dry, but there's no rush. Once it dries, you won't even see it, and it will keep your flowers in place. This dandelion looks really cool beside the butterfly. <laughs> okay, Gumboot Kids. Now let's see what you've made. We all made butterflies. Pressed flowers are beautiful. <laughs> what do you think, Daisy? These are wonderful. You are all so crafty, Gumboot Kids. I've made a butterfly just like the one I saw in my garden. Oh, look! There it is now! <laughs> See you later, Gumboot Kids! Goodbye, Daisy! D-O-Y, D-O-Y, Daisy, what are we making today?